morning guys so we out here on Mslanga beach this morning looks like I'm the only one out fishing this morning over there it looks like there's a couple of guys on the rocks but not much so it is Thursday morning it's around about quarter to six now high tide is working its way out moving into low tide right now so I'm here checking how the ocean might be oh is that a very good spot over there we can try from here and move our way back there again this is how the water isn't still dirty we'll see if anything comes out Let's see if I look over there looks like a few people on the rocks I'm not sure if they're fishing but nobody on the surf this morning water looks good especially the spot over here doesn't look too wavy and there's another spot over there right there it looks quite interesting but we'll start it off here guys I'll just hook up the gear quickly put everything together and we'll see what we get out of the water but hopefully there's no muck and hopefully the undercurrent is good as well but we'll see beautiful morning guys stay tuned alright so the first thing we're gonna do what I always do is I start off with a full sardine and work my way from there you know always start with a full sardine see see how rough the shadow biting you know and then work it from there never know I might just cook something first time Right, full sardine. It's always best to get the nice frozen sardine. Right, all hooked up. Let's cast this guy in and see if there's any takers. Oh, got my bucket.
so tide is going out slowly now still nothing hooked yet the current at the bottom of the water is a little bit rough also my line keeps getting tangled up But as the tide gets lower, the water seems to get a bit more calmer. So we'll, we'll give it a couple of more minutes or half an hour or so. See what happens. Just to show you how deep the water is there. There's a guy swimming right there in the water. So he's quite deep. As, this, as you can see in this bank right in front here, he's a bit deep. So it looks like they're going to be testing the water here now guys Not quite sure They're probably testing the E. coli levels So we'll see now How's it? Oh, you boss, you okay? How are you? I'm good, you? You're on your job, no? Yeah. <laughs> Where's the other guy? Yeah. Oh, there he is. You're the only one patrolling this beach. Yeah. <laughs> For now.
Nothing, my man. Try morning. Must I sign? Yeah. It's very dry this morning, yeah. Okay. No problem. Thank you, man. Thanks, boss. He's at home. He didn't want to get up this morning. <laughs> he was sleeping. Ah, uh, chop. So guys, those were the guys from fisheries. They basically checking our permits to make sure that we have a license to fish. Just a word of advice, they're always on the beach nowadays. They're doing their job. So when you come out angling, make sure you've got your license ready, guys. And make sure you've got the proper license also. We were chased off the beach the last time because we had an incorrect license. We had a bait license only not a fishing license so make sure you tick the correct boxes in the license in the license papers guys before you go and buy a license So guys, that's it for today. Didn't catch anything today. We tried at the Mshlanga beach today, but nothing. Maybe next time. But uh, yeah guys, the water was alright. But unfortunately no fish. Unlucky. Tried till the last. Maybe we should give it another couple of days. See what happens. But anyway guys, like you saw today, when you come into the beach, make sure that you got your license because they are checking, they are checking licenses. And if you don't have, they will escort you off the beach guys or they will give you a hefty fine. So make sure you got your license guys and uh, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe. We will be bringing in some more fishing this year. But uh, yeah, that's it for me guys. High Tide Angler out. See you in the next one.